The next big trend in cosmetic surgery, people going under the knife to look like their perfect selfies. The social media makeovers are inspired by those filtered photos on Instagram. They're filtered people. ABC's Lindsay Janice, though, has more. They're some of the most desired celebrity features. Natalie Portman's nose, Jennifer Garner's defined jaw, Angelina Jolie's luscious lips, and Beyonce's flawless skin. But now, instead of bringing photos of steamy stars to the plastic surgeon's office, some people are getting a bit more real. Now people are coming in with Instagram filters. Instagram setting off one of the hottest new trends in cosmetic surgery. Patients asking doctors to alter their appearance to make them look in real life, like the selfies they take using one of the app's photo filters. Those filters capable of boosting selfie esteem. I tested them out. Willow making my face look a little more defined. Early bird giving me a warm, softer glow. Janet Ross says she fell in love with the way she felt the Amaro filter improved her snaps. All of a sudden I was like, wow, you know, I can totally post this because I think I look really good. You know, I'm softer. The 47-year-old asking her doctor to mimic the filter but make the results a little more permanent. I have the fillers in the sides here, on the lips a little bit, and then the Botox. Dr. Jonathan Kaplan, a plastic surgeon, says he's been able to help many of his patients like Ross ditch those Instagram filters without going under the knife. The patients that are coming in with the filters for Instagram are mostly concerned about the wrinkles around their mouth, complexion, different blemishes and dark spots or red spots. And that's great for them because you don't really need any surgical procedures for that. But some psychiatrists say this latest quest for selfie improvement could be dangerous. Filters are something special that are designed for a camera, not a plastic surgeon's fingers. As for Ross, she says she has no regrets. I feel way more confident. I don't need the filters anymore. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Janice, ABC News, New York.